My first day, I was not expecting to be handed, uh, you know, a computer and an iPad. I thought it was just going to be a lot of kind of the dirty work, doing <laughs> coffee runs, mopping the floors. Turned out that was the complete opposite. Um, it ended up being more of like a kind of a management trainee. I, you know, I learned more in this internship than I think I have in four years of college. And actually have responsibilities and work to do uh, to the point where you're going home and you're thinking about it at night is a good thing. I feel like I was actually like a actual employee of the company. I liked feeling I was actually like a part of the project, a part of the whole entire company. I like the, the number of interns and the number of co-ops. It's a lot smaller scale than what I've heard uh, other big general contractors have. And I think that, that hands-on time, that personal time that you have with your mentor and with others, it really goes a long way because everybody will know your name by the end um, if you do your job right. There, I don't feel like there isn't a person I can't reach out to if I really needed to. So I think that, that's pretty much the, the big thing. To the point where when Turner Burton came out of the job site, like I've never spoken to any other president of any other company. And he spoke to me, we had like a five minute conversation, but it still, you know, it still meant something. Probably the coolest thing was uh, being able to drive equipment around I got forklift certified. I figured I'd be more of a desk gal, but after this, I, I honestly think superintendent and being more out in the field would be a better fit for me, especially early on. So I would say that this internship has only like confirmed that I'm like on the right track for sure. I found out I was going to Chattanooga on this manufacturing plant. I got pretty excited to find out that I was, who I was going to be working with and the project I was going to be on. I liked seeing new cities and meeting new people, so that was always fun. I was living in Atlanta. Uh, I lived on the outskirts, but it's really cool because the Atlanta office is in the Battery, and it's right located right across from the Braves Stadium. So that was really cool. I probably went to like seven Braves games um, after work. I would say that, like, aside from the work, the number one reason that I would want to come back to Hoare is the camaraderie here. Um, I, I made some amazing friends here, and, and everybody I work with it is just great. So it's a good family atmosphere, and you get to meet all the other interns and hang out with them. Like right now, the job we're doing is a concrete pour with all the interns. It was very important. So I mean, these are people, people you're probably going to end up working with in your career down the road. So you get to meet them early and build relationships. No matter what, like where you're put and like who you're put with, you're going to learn something out of it, and you get as much as you put in. And Poor makes it really easy to learn a lot from it. It was a little nerve-wracking to leave New Jersey and go so far away from home and be alone all summer. It's been a great experience and I've learned so much and even if you're not necessarily considering construction, the knowledge you'll gain from an internship at Hoare is just invaluable.